Hey guys, it's uh, Friday, and this week's topic is school, passing, and bathrooms, all related to school. Um, I have yet to be Dylan at school. I'm probably going to do that this year. Actually, I am doing it this year. Um, my parents have no idea. I go... Sorry, I just woke up. It's like 2.18 and I just woke up. Um... I go back to school Wednesday the 31st or some shit like that. I don't fucking know. Um, my guidance counselor gets back into her office the 29th. Um, so I'm going in to school the 29th and I'm going to talk to her about shit. Um, I think I pass pretty well. Like my voice isn't... If you hear noises in the background, it's because I'm fucking playing Sims. But... Um, I think I pass pretty well. I mean, my voice isn't incredibly deep, but it's not incredibly high either. Um, my binder makes my chest look... I'm so fucking tired. I apologize. Um, my binder makes my chest look pretty flat. Um, I mean, I'm not... I was never girly or anything like that. So, I mean, the style that I have this year is a bunch of... Uh, like polo like shirts uh v-necks and they're really good because they don't show my binder um white t-shirts and jeans like it's no big deal the jeans i have make it look like i'm packing um i made a video on my regular channel about me being nervous for gym class and basically what i decided is i'm not ashamed to be transgender so if that means i have to change with the females that's fine i mean girls are hot so I mean, not that I look anyway, because I think it's awkward, but, um, I have no problem. Like, I've decided recently that I'm not going to be ashamed to be transgender. I don't care. I'll be a boy in the girls' locker room, whatever. Um, but if, you know, people start complaining and shit like that, that's when I have to take, you know, initiative to do what I gotta do, like, I mean, I'm okay with it. It's I don't want to make other people feel uncomfortable. I plan on starting testosterone around when I turn 18. So, I mean, I'm already have a mustache now. It's blonde, so you can't see it, but you can like feel it. Um, so, if at the end of the semester there's this person with the mustache, beard, deep voice, no chest in the girls' locker room. I'm afraid it's going to make my school look bad if someone just decides to come in and look at the school or some shit. Um, basically, I'm going to ask my guidance counselor what bathroom I should use. I mean, I'm probably going to hold my piss anyway because the fucking bathrooms are disgusting. Or I'll just go to the nurse like I normally do. Um, but I'm probably going to ask her about that. I'm going to ask her if she can email all my teachers since we don't get our class schedule until the first day of school. So, basically, I'm just going to ask here if the gym teachers can call me Dylan. It's a pretty gender-neutral name. I mean, it's more towards males, but I'm just going to see if they can respect that I want to be called Dylan instead of Erica. And if they can respect using male pronouns. If not, that's fine for gym class. I just don't want to be called my birth name at all. I want to be Dylan. That's who I am. So, I think they should respect that. Or they can call me my last name. That's perfectly fine. Um... They did that last, last two years when I had gym. My teacher, last three years, they just called me Myers, Myers, Myers. That's what I went by for softball, everything like that. So, I mean, if all comes down to it, if my teachers cannot call me Dylan until I'm 18 or whatever, I'll just go by my last name. Like, that's no problem. Um, yeah, I mean, I'll probably make a video on my regular channel and my dog just freaked out. And if she starts barking, I apologize. Um, if worst comes to worst, I get called Myers the entire year, that's fine. And then second semester, I can start, you know, as Dylan, because we have four classes and then stops and then four classes. So, yeah. 
um, passing I'm fine with. If anyone calls me my birth name, I'm just going to ignore them. Um, the attendance lady said that one on I turn 18, that I just have to get papers signed that I'm my own person, so they can't have they can't ask my dad, my parents anymore. And then I can legally change my name and everything, which I am saving up for, which I don't have a job. So basically, what I would probably do is I'll ask my parent, my dad, for lunch money or some shit, and then make my own lunch. Oh yeah, look, I got a rainbow bracelet. And I kind of like it, because it's rainbow, and I like colors and rainbows, and I'm also, I like, I'm bi, like, ish, I don't really fucking know, that's next week's video, so yeah, my dog is freaking out right now, um, what else about school, I've never had problems in school, I was, ninth grade, I was very in the closet, very, no, I'm straight, what the fuck you talking about, I had boyfriends and shit like that, um, 10th grade, I was very, like, fuck it, I like girls kind of thing. Um, and I never got, shut up! And I never got bullied or anything like that. Last year, I was very, very open about my sexuality. I was like, I like girls, if you got a problem with it, come fight me. Like, whatever. Didn't really bother me. Um, middle school, I had trouble with it. I got called a dyke a lot, but high school, I've had no problems with it whatsoever. I mean, there was at least one other person in my class who was either... More homo, like, like, flaming homosexual, like, my best friend James, he was in a lot of my classes, and, like, you can just tell he's gay, like, he has no problem, he's all like, well, so, um, that helped me a lot, um, last year I was in the theater class, and, well, it's theater, so, but their theater is one of the most accepting people in the entire world. So if you're having trouble and you're LGBT, I suggest joining theater just because they're the, one of the most accepting people in the entire world. Um, I mean, you know, you get, like, dyke and lesbian and, like, you know, like... Gym class, I've never had a problem, actually. I mean, everyone knows I like girls and, like, my friends will be in my locker row. And I used to, like, hide myself, like, my face, like, buried in my locker so I wouldn't look at anyone so no one thought I was looking at them. And the one time my friend was like, what the fuck are you doing? And I was like, well, I don't want to make anyone feel uncomfortable. Like, it's obvious that I'm gay. Like, I don't want anyone to think I'm staring at them. And she was like, you can fucking stare at me. I don't give a fuck. Like, I feel complimented if you're looking at my body. Like, and all my friends were like, yeah, like, you know, if you want to look at my body and, like, like it, that's fine. Like, Whatever. and I was really really fucking confused it took me a while till my friend was like st took my face and was like stare at my chest bitch now to me to realize that it's not awkward it's just awkward for me because I'm an awkward person um what else I'm like waiting for gym class to get like letters and shit like oh you're a fucking dyke all this bullshit um, but last year when I just shaved my head and decided I was going to go by Drew at the time, most of my teachers were really okay with it. My, um, psychology teacher picked up on it like that. Like, as soon as I shaved my head, Andrew, Andrew and my mom's home. So, other than that, it was nice talking to you guys. I'm really fucking tired. <laughs>